Many times the knowledge that we gather through spiritual knowledge, scriptures and all these things, they become a hindrance. In spirituality, we call this kind of incident as glimpse. Probably you can call Satori. Satori. A glimpse of enlightenment. A drop of enlightenment. That what she explained. In fact, everyone is searching for that experience. Everybody. No one is exceptional. But they have no clue about it. They are, they are diverting all these things to something else here and there and there and there. By just distraction. All distractions. It is called diving in, not distracting out. Only two things possible. Either distracting out or diving in. <laughs> At the age of five, she dived in. In fact, it's not efforted by her, it happened. Enlightenment is a happening. Nobody can do it. We can only create a climate. We can create a platform in which it happens. So at the age of five, it happened to her. This is blessing. She is clever enough. She has not missed it. She has not forgotten it. Of course, it's not able to be forgotten. It's such a profound experience. All mind experience you may forget. Because they are all just movies, part of the movies. This is not part of the movie. This is end of the movie. And witnessing the screen. When the movie is ended, the, the screen appears. <laughs> it's a screen experience, not a movie experience. So that gave such a remembrance in her from the age of five, and it repeated again at the age of 36. See how many years? 31 years in between. After 31 years, she experienced the same that she experienced at the age of five. Diving in, diving in. This is called diving in experience. Not diverting out. Now the thing is that, is there any possibility to retain with that, to stay with that? That's the question now, at least for her. <laughs>